Within our classroom, we're looking to install uh, bench tops and cabinetry that will allow students to do um, some experimentations uh, that will include sinks. Um, we're also looking to make this a mixed use classroom and to that end we want to be able to have uh, tables and, and uh, seating that will be conf easily configurable. Well I'm very pleased to uh, give my support and endorsement to uh, Rookery Bay. It's a absolute gem that we have this in southwest Florida. So it's important that we have education programs, outreach programs that Rookery Bay is already putting on. And so any additional facilities that are being created down at the place to uh, enhance that outreach has my full endorsement. We could actually come here and do a field experience. We could do some sampling, phytoplankton sampling, benthic sampling and bring the samples directly back to the classroom and lab space for the students to go through and look at. I mean, if you can just get them out on the water and let them see the crazy cool stuff that lives here, then, you're, then you've got their interest and how that develops and what they end up doing. Um, who knows, but it's gotta be a good thing. Well, I just wanna say how lucky are we that this is one of, uh, out of 28 in the country that we actually see and not too many people know. And until today, I didn't know this actually existed. Well, in a scientific point of view, I mean, it gives you such a broad spectrum of what is out there, you know, so it opens my eyes to many other things, not only my career path I'm going to follow, but also I can teach my children, you know, in the future, to will come down and this will still be here and, you know, be, be one of the greatest things to actually share that with them. Our Shell Island Road field station currently provides a newly renovated dormitory with an array of vessels and provides direct access to tens of thousands of acres of mangroves and the estuarine habitats. We have a steady stream of students uh, who are interested in learning about our ecosystem and culture. Renovating the laboratory will give us the tools we need to accommodate more scientists and research with the end goal of helping us manage these lands and waters for future generations. You will be making an investment into the future of this place by providing the necessary educational and outreach tools that will allow us to train the future scientists and citizen stewards of tomorrow. Thank you.